This guide shows you a couple of little shortcuts in Windows 10 using the run command. Some of these commands might also apply to earlier versions of Windows 2. So first of all, we need to get the run box up. Now to do this, we need to press the Windows key, which is on your keyboard. The Windows key is located between the CTRL or Control key and the ALT key. On the bottom row of keys on your keyboard on the left hand side. Hold this down now. Then tap the letter R, R for Romeo. The run box will now appear. Delete out whatever's in it and first of all, for example, if we wanted to get to the control panel, the old Windows control panel, we just type in there control panel and then press enter or return on the keyboard. And as you can see, the control panel appears. Okay, so I'm gonna press the Windows key again. So hold down the Windows key, tap the letter R and this time perhaps we want the Windows key, uh, sorry, the um, printers, so we type control printers and up will come devices and printers. Let's go back into the run box. So I'm going to press the Windows key again and the letter R and say if we want to go to the old programs and features box or add remove programs, we type app with dot cpl and then press enter or return on the keyboard and up comes the uninstall or change a program or programs and features window. If say we wanted to go into the internet properties for Internet Explorer, hold down the Windows key, tap the letter R and we just type INET CPL full stop CPL and then press enter or return on the keyboard and up comes the internet properties window. If we want to go into the date time properties, again, we hold down the Windows key and tap the letter R, delete out whatever's in the box, and type control time date dot CPL, and then press enter or return, and there you go, you can change the date and the time. Another one I've just remembered is the system properties. So again, hold down the Windows key, tap the letter R, and then type control SYS dm.cpl and then press enter or return and up comes the system properties. So that's just a guide on using the run command to get to certain control panel icons or areas on your computer quicker. Hope this guide helps. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Wait YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.